The Night Sea Stereo Microscope Fluorescence Adapter is just what the name implies. A simple way to adapt existing stereos with a versatile fluorescence capability. Uh, adds on to your, your microscopes you already own with no modification to the microscope itself. First thing we're going to do is turn this uh, microscope back into an ordinary stereo. And done. That's all there is to it. Uh, the only thing we're putting on the microscope is this empty adapter ring. This goes where a ring light would attach. Uh, diameter difference is made up with the thumb screws, makes it pretty much universal. And we do have uh, some custom adapters for some oddball microscopes. That ring is empty, so it's not in your way when you're doing other uh, white light work. We're going to demonstrate with our uh, pet rock here from New Jersey. Fluorescence comes down to excitation and emission. Excitation, we're doing with high intensity LED light heads. These are modular. So if you need a different color, you just put in a different light head. Each light head is dedicated to a color. It's not a white light source with a, with a filter. This is the light source based on LEDs. Color is indicated by the, uh, the strip on it. Uh, instant on, instant off, low heat, very long lifetime, all the advantages you get from LEDs. Now it looks like we're shining bright blue light on the rock, which is not that interesting, so we need a barrier filter. Uh, its job is to block all the excitation light and transmit the fluorescence. And the purpose of the adapter ring is to hold this in the optical path so that when you are uh, either looking through the microscope with your eyes or a camera, you'll see the fluorescence. And that just attaches magnetically to that adapter ring. Easy to put on. Uh, you don't want to work with bright light in your face, so we have a viewing shield that just pivots into place. And that's not only protection against the reflected excitation light, that's also a filter itself, so if you look through it, you can see the fluorescence. If you need another excitation emission combination, they come in a nice little kit like this. Foam line box has the uh, excitation light source, in this case uh, indicated by the green for stimulating red fluorescence with the matching red barrier filter and shield. So switching between colors is a simple matter of one, two, three off, one, two, three on. Uh, at the time of recording this video, we have six different excitation emission combinations available.